good invention can change the world, or it could change a single person's life for the better. When Dr. Patricia Bath invented the method and apparatus for ablating and removing cataract lenses, what she named the laser phaco probe, that's exactly what she did. She helped blind people see again. Let's learn more about Patricia Bath and her life-changing invention, the laser phaco probe. Patricia Bath's extraordinary career as an ophthalmologist, laser scientist, site advocate, inventor, professor, and community organizer, had humble beginnings as she persevered and overcame the obstacles of sexism and racism in the United States. She was born in Harlem, New York in 1942 and attended segregated schools. She was encouraged by her parents to excel in her high school and university studies. She was only 16 when she won her first award for scientific research. She went on to study medicine at Howard University College of Medicine, interned at ha Harlem Hospital, and completed a fellowship in ophthalmology at Columbia University. And it was during this time that she observed the disparity of care between black and white people. She did a study that showed that blindness in black people was twice as high as in white people. This led her to create the field of community ophthalmology to increase and improve care in underserved populations. Patricia Bath was the first woman and the first African American in many of the things she did, like when she became a faculty member in the Department of Ophthalmology at UCLA's Jules Stein Eye Institute. And when the United States sexism and racism held her back, she went to Europe so that she could keep accomplishing things in laser science and eye research which led her to the invention of a new device and method of removing cataracts, the laser phaco probe. The laser phaco probe is a surgical tool that uses a laser to ablate or break up cataract tissue via a tiny one millimeter insertion into the patient's eye. To better understand, let's take a look at the parts of the eye. This diagram shows a front view and an inside cross section view. The white part is called the sclera, the colored part is called the iris, the dark circle in the middle is called the pupil, the cornea covers the outside, and the lens is on the inside. Cataracts are cloudy blemishes on the lens and can make people blind. Now, to understand Dr. Patricia Bath's groundbreaking and life-changing cataract laser phaco probe, we can examine this patent diagram, which is part of U.S. Patent 4,744,360, which was issued on May 17, 1988. The laser phaco probe consists of a flexible tube that is inserted into the eye to the cataract. In the tube is an optical fiber that delivers light radiation, the laser, that distinct disintegrates the cataract. The fiber is surrounded by a sleeve that pushes in liquid and an aspirator sleeve that sucks out the liquid and the disintegrated cataract. The eye is then ready to have a new flexible lens inserted. We've looked at a 2D diagram of the human eye. Now let's take a look at a 3D model. Here it is. Let's identify the parts. We know that the white part is called the sclera. The colored part is called the iris. The dark circle in the middle is called the pupil. The outside covering is called the cornea. Now, to see the lens, we have to look on the inside. Here we go. Let's pretend this syringe is a cataract, a laser phaco probe, with its flexible one millimeter tube that delivers laser energy, as well as an irrigation and an aspiration sleeve. We locate on the 3D model where to make a one millimeter incision to insert the cataract laser, fa laser phaco probe, which is the syringe in this case, to remove the cataract, which is on the lens, from the eye. Now imagine 
laser radiation going in and breaking up that cataract tissue, then adding pressure to the probe to add liquid to irrigate, then adding suction to draw out the cataract particles and the liquid. Now we insert a new flexible lens and all this was done with only one incision. Cataracts are cloudy blemishes on the lens of the eye that can lead to blindness. Previous treatments were somewhat harsh and sometimes risky, involving mechanical grinding. Patricia Bath's invention created a faster, safer, and more accurate technique. With her laser phaco probe, Bath was able to help restore the sight of individuals who had been blind for more than 30 years. Let's look at this eye chart with and without cloudy glasses to get a sense of how important cataract surgery is. What do you see? Letters, right? Okay, if you had cataracts, the chart may look like you were wearing glasses with tape on them, like this. Now what do you see? Not much. After the simple treatment with the laser phaco probe and an insertion of a new lens, voila, you can see again. When I need to be reminded about good changes and good people, I like to think about Patricia Bath. Throughout her life, her guiding slogan has been, fight for the right to sight. And whether it was through scientific research, medicine, education, advocacy, or inventing, that is what she did for six decades. I wonder what my guiding slogan is. Hmm, I'll have to think about that. What will yours be?